the 16 months, man. I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with BSAA Chris, okay? As much as I don't really mind old Chris, BSAA Chris is fuck ridiculous, and you know me, I like, I like Cyber Akuma. Fuck ridiculous, best ridiculous. Ghost Agent! Welcome back, Ghost Agent. Thank you, dude. Um, okay, so, I'm gonna fire this up, I'm gonna BRB, I'm gonna let you guys enjoy the wonderful intro. And let's get this shit started. Welcome back to the stage of history. I'm gonna go 9x. Thank you, dude. Well, we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their Chris, mission. You found it yet? No, not yet, Brad. Bizarre murder. Welcome back to the, the stage of history. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris. Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Welcome back to the stage of history. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. We continued our search for the other members. And it turned into... a nightmare. This way. Now I know we didn't finish up Resident Evil 1 the other day on Sega Saturn. So I did something for you all. Only three stars members left now. Captain Wesker. Jill and myself. We don't know where Barry is. I'm gonna meet you guys halfway. I don't know what happened. Barry! Where's Barry? He's probably... No. What is that? I'll go and check. Okay, Jill and I will stay in the hall in case of an emergency. Chris, take care. Yes. Yes. I told you guys I'd meet you halfway, all right? I think this is a good halfway. I think this is good, okay? This is what we all wanted, right? This is what we all wanted. 
Original voices and original PS1 models. I think they look great. Welcome I think this looks great. Look at this. I'm gonna hack up these fucking zombos. Jackson 1995, thank you, dude. Rip scale bound. One of the few games I was looking forward to on the Xbox is no more. I now look to PS4 with Horizon Zero Dawn and Neo. Yeah, pretty much, right? I don't know many other games that system has on it that is gonna keep me interested, that's for sure. Especially with KI being on PC. Uh, Cobaltos or Cobaltios, thank you very much, dude. Tacos for Cobaltios. Dapper Cactuar and the Neighborly Hobo, welcome, guys. And then there was also, uh... Jock I the Now, thank you and welcome back, dude. Tex Max also back for two months. Amigo 9X for five. Ghost Agent BP9 for five. And Carlos, five bucks to say 6 a.m. Hype with Resident Evil and Max. Thank you. Let's pick this shit up. I'll take the, the ink ribbon. I'll, I'll take it. You know what? Maybe a better layout might suit us a little bit better. A neighborly Hobo, thank you, dude. Let's see if we got something good. Let's see if we got anything good. That one? Maybe? Think I can use this one? Let's get a good look at Chris. I think Chris looks great. How dare you? It's an old typewriter. You can save your progress. Use ink ribbon. Hell no. So, I'm trying to figure out the fucking buttons in this shit, because B is the menu. B is the fucking menu. Uh, B is status. Yes, that's what they want it to be. Yes, that's what they want it to be. Uh, Gigabyte, thank you for the 32 months, dude. Malicia is back for nine months as well. Kangar, thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate it, guys. Uh, this looks great. This looks great. Do I even have a knife? No, I don't. Wow. Holy shit, Chris does not get a knife. I mean, I'm sorry, a goo goo a goo one. Let's say no to that. Looks like he got caught in half. Let's get a good look at this guy. I think I think this is awesome. Still playing tank? Yes, I'm playing tank controls. I'm just only able to do this because I'm that good. All right, here we go. No, this isn't a mod. I've just played it so much. Yeah, it's probably not Chris's blood, considering I'm alive. <laughs> now look at the zombie. Take take a look at that zombo. Look at him. Oh! He's terrifying! Horrible! Horrible freaky zombo! Oh my god, Swindlefed Ari Survivor! Thank you very much, Swindlefed. I love how absolutely no one streams or speaks of Ari Survivor. I wonder if everyone is even trying to get rid of their copy of it. Hint, hint. Hmm. Ah. Uh, I wonder. I wonder. Did you see how creepy that fucking Zombo looked? I don't want to pick that up yet. It's crazy. It's like... It's awesome. Who would play it any other way? Like, ex exactly. Who would play it any other way? J Wills three sevens. Thank you, J Wills. Welcome, dude. Talk was for J. Wesker, chill. What happened to Jill and Wesker? Where did they go? Triple combo. There we go. I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna use this one. We're gonna see how this works. Hold on a sec. Uh, X Altus 1X. Tacos for X Altus. Thank you very much, dude. Welcome, man. How much RE7 will I stream? Very little. I'm probably only gonna be streaming, like, just the beginning or just Leon's campaign in that game. Uh, hold on a sec. Let me get the camera up in here. Welcome back to the stage Slackware, thank history. you, dude. I think this is a little bit better. A wee bit. A wee bit. Welcome back to the stage of history. That's panic attacks as well. Thank you, man. Gotta be so sensitive with this shit. Mm 
Damn it. Okay, hold on a sec. Let me get this thing fixed. Can you guys hear the music okay? Let me know. There we go. There we go. The way it should be. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking of doing RE2. I'm probably going to play the Dreamcast version of RE2 because I have not done that one. And it's uh, it runs at 60. Apparently it actually runs at 60 frames per second. Damn it, never gonna get used to that. Uh, one man tango, thank you, dude. Defensive items, ooh. Uh, hold on a sec, let me see if I can actually change the controls, because it's bugging the fuck out of me that B is... Welcome back to the stage of history. B is reload, okay. And then start is options, okay, this is much better. This is, this is much better. Uh, Flash Neko, thank you, dude. Oh god. Oh god, what the- ooh. I guess it's not so bad, I have to use L to sh L to look. And then triangle is... Might like this one a little bit more. And then the triggers are attack. Okay. This, I mean, this might not be so bad. What's code Veronica? It's a, it's a game that came out after Resident Evil 3. Um, it's completely a polygonal style game. On the Dreamcast it originally came out on, but it's on GameCube, and it's on... what's it called? Um, on GameCube and... I think a PS2. But! It's... Uh, it's not... it's not great in my opinion. It's not great. I'm not a big fan of Code Veronica. Resident Evil Outbreak with subs on the revived servers? I'm slightly curious. Slightly curious. Welcome back to the stage of history. Yo, Appy137, thank you, dude. It's funny, the audio of this game is like kind of naturally low. You know what I'm thinking it is? Oh, they are all the way the fuck up. Yes! Weird. Ah, yes! Crimson Raven! Yes! For reasons. For, for reasons. Thank you, dude. Jill again? Why not Chris this time? Malachi? Uh, wait, what? You think this is Jill? You think this is Jill? You think this is Jill? I mean, I can see he's very beautiful. He's, he's extremely beautiful. But I don't know how you can get the iconic Christopher Redfield mixed up with Jill. Yes, I would, I would be doing, I'm sorry. Uh, I am I am definitely streaming RE7. And I do want to play RE6. The gunshots. Feel good. I think he's dead. I think he's dead. Uh-oh. This guy had a bad day. This guy had a bad day. He's also not wearing pants. Oh no, he doesn't have any ammo. He doesn't have any ammo. RE6 Leon is what I meant to say. If I said RE7, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, this is remastered. It's remastered as fuck. Yeah, even the zombies are remastered. Damn it, it's already different! Shit! I thought I had to use the, uh, fuck! It's already different, fuck! It's a problem. Okay, so everything in here is locked. Sword keys, armor keys, everything like that. Are the Crimson Heads modeled? We're gonna, dude, we're gonna have to find out. I've never played the game through with Resident Evil re 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 remaster I've never played it this way, so we're, we're gonna find out together.
The PS4 Pro isn't a goner, I just can't get 1080p to show up. I can only get 4K and much lower to show up right now. Look at this. Dynamic lighting. He looks like he came out of Virtua Cop. It's beautiful. It's beautiful! Instant death. Yeah, I know Chris does not get the lockpick, but Chris gets the lighter. Like, he naturally has the lighter? Yes. That's what I thought. Okay, I'm gonna leave those here because I'll know that they are there. Should be fine. Pretty bold, aren't we? I'll take care of you myself! Welcome back to the Majora 185, thank you for the 16 months, dude. Did I try to stream using the PS4? No, I've never done that. I don't even know how that works. Rrr! Oh shit. Sir? Welcome back to the stage Sir? Of history. Sir? Sir, you're angry. Ryujin, thank you, dude. CR Maxwell, thank you for the 24 months. I'll take the Jolden Arrow. Oh god, Chris. Chris, it's about to be a fucking problem, sir. Ah! Don't do the go give him the second bite, you fuck! Okay, this is still locked. Uh, Black Math, that's a brand new dude. Tacos for Black Math, thank you, man. And Big TF, also back for five months. Thank you, dude. The stage of history. Unlocked it. That's good news. We're making progress. It might be going the right way. I agree. He's too well modeled. He is modeled too well. Is this the one I came out of or the one I... Hmm. Not sure. Not sure. Yes, it, it totally fucking was. I need to go in the other door. Nobody said there'd be math! Oh. Uh. Actually, I think I need to take the... The arrows... Yes. Yes, there we go. Cool. Already in caution, thick. I need to go find an item box. And it's locked. Motherfucker. Spiked Freak, thank you very much, dude. Tacos, or welcome back, Spiked Freak. That's a sword key. This guy's, uh... This guy's Come running. On, Angry Crunkin is a brand new dude as well. Thank you, Angry Crunkin. Enjoy the taco, sir. Let's see if I can actually push this off without combating this dank whore. The zombies, this zombie's heavily modeled. I just realized only some zombies are. Please dodge. Thank you very much for the four months, dude. And Shadow Root, thank you, thank you for the thirteen months. Yeah, I'll stick the dagger. Welcome back. Defensive weapons, I get it. Of history. You have to press LB to use a defensive weapon. I didn't know that. I gave him the jukes. Ah! Fuck. Hey yo, I are Chris, 500 bits. Video game based on the hit movies to give you Milia side boob. If you wanted that, you should watch Fifth Element. But thank you, IR Chris. Okay, I'm gonna go get the fucking map. That looks awesome! Look how fucking sick this looks! You know what's bugging me is that for some reason the audio of this game is really low. Like, I'm having to, like, crank it. 
and I want it to be louder. Here, hold on a sec, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill this for a sec. I'm gonna make sure. Oh, oh, Jesus, that would be why. Fun fact, guy. A donkey by the name of Jimmy earned the rank of sergeant in the British Army during World War One. There was something else that was like that. Did you already give us that one? I feel like I've heard that one before. I feel like I might have heard it before. Unless I can get rid of that. Bing. Okay. All right. Here we go. <laughs> That's nice of you, Super Saiyan. Thank you, dude. Uh. It's funny, this- this puzzle is completely different. It doesn't have the step stool. Ribbit. That's a little too loud on your guys' end. Let me balance it out. Okay, there we go. Map of the mansion. Now what's over here? Is it even worth it? There's like something. It's like ammo. I guess it is worth it because I have the ammo and he's gonna take all but maybe six or seven shots to kick to take out. So I'll just light him up. Oh, it's just a dagger. God damn it. Not worth it. Not worth it. I thought it was ammo. Wolf Sajin, thank you, dude. Oh, he looks so scary! Oh my god, it was a waste of fucking ammo! Dickhead! I'll just let you... Wait a minute, can't you get back the dagger if you shoot him? Don't you get it back, like, if you murder him? Okay, there's blood, he's dead. Oh, you cannot! No, you cannot! Fuck! Well, that was fucking pointless. That was- that was fucking pointless. Yeah, he looks really real. I know, right? It's locked! I need the sword key! Fuckers! Okay, where the hell are we supposed to go, Chris? Everything's different. Has to be a headshot, okay. Aren't headshots, like, kind of, like, fucking random? You have to, like, blow off their head or something like that. J-Wills, I need Jessica coming up with a new recipe Ignis style. Art monsters, I call to you. <laughs> Thank you, dude. Oh, that's right, all I gotta do is use my lighter. I just gotta light shit on fire, right? Okay. That's locked. That guy's chilling. This is probably nothing. Oh. Hey, well look at that shit. I have one of those. Rodzilla, thank you, dude. I got one of these. Fuck down there, Christopher. Please don't let me fight Captain What's-His-Face. Guy's a serious piece of shit. I haven't even gotten to a save point yet. No, I have to, like, unlock this shit. The Book of Curses. Yeah, sure, why not? That sounds great. That sounds great. RE1 movie! Thank you very much, dude. When Alice wakes up in the operating chair after being taken from the building, if you pause at the right moment, she falls out of the chair, and you can see her cat hair. I'm sure we all feel very educated by knowing that. Open it up! Oh, hey, look at that. Yes. Look at curses, the four masks, okay. Yes, evil will awaken. The crimson head. I don't think I awaken him now. But at least I got 
Sword key? Sword key! Alright, let's start let's start getting around this fucking mansion. Start making it happen. Oh, sir. Excuse me. I'm gonna stab you. Leave me the fuck alone. Hey, chill out, buddy. Shotgun shells over there that I cannot do anything with. Oh, yes, I understand. Crimson Head's the same as Hunter's? No, Crimson Head's are a unique enemy that was put into just this game. And they fuck shit up. They are zombies, but they run, and they are very hard to put down. They are actually possibly one of the scariest enemies in classic Resident Evil games. Um, yeah, they are... They're zombies that are smart, and they're fucking pissed. There we go. There we go. Progress. Yeah, apparently the KOF 14 patches up, but they didn't fix matchmaking or the netcode, which is depressing. Yeah, I'll just move these. Another knife. Welcome back to the stage of Brooklyn Killer, thank you for the 22 months, man. Oh, 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 oh. Is there even a quick turnaround in this fucking game? Bobski, thank you, dude. I don't think there is shit. Bush. Well, that didn't want to do what I wanted it to do. Welcome back to the stage of history. There's that ammo clip. Zach Decker, thank you for the 21 months, man. And Yuri Yokosan, thank you for the five months as well. Well, tank controls are mapped to the, uh, tank controls are on... Yeah, it's it's with X. Tank controls are actually mapped to the D-pad in this game, so if you use the analog stick, you get analog controls. If you use the, uh, the D-pad, you get tank controls. Kind of awesome. It's kind of awesome. Alright, here we go! Here we go! Heyo! A RyePT Onyx! Is a brand new dude. Thank you for Rye PT Onyx. You look just as good as Chris does in this current screenshot. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Combo. Arts and Shafts is also a brand new dude. Holy shit, tacos for Arts and Shafts. As well as Magic Flying Taco 1 and a Rye PT Onyx. Holy shit, where are you guys all coming from? And also, Stonekeeper of the World, everyone, all these dudes were brand fucking new. This is getting crazy. Thank you guys, god damn. That is nutty. I know Barry doesn't save your ass here. So I can't, uh, rely on Barry for some bullshit. You get the shotgun. Water still works. Chris, man up and fucking get whatever's in the toilet. Welcome back to the stage of history. Oh, dirty water. Remove the plug. Yes, unleash the zombo. Book the jester. Thank you, dude. That looks great. That looks fantastic. Oh no, he's got boxy hands. This looks good. This looks good. <laughs> Ay! Take that. Oh no! God damn it. Well, I'm gonna keep that guy in there. I'll keep that guy in there for later. We're gonna come back to him and uh should be great. I heard something. Pretty sure Zambinos are gonna bust through those doors any day now. Any day now. Uh oh. I think this is where I can't do shit right now until I get the fake shotgun. Hmm, more stuff. And hey, that's an ink ribbon I can use. Holy shit! We want Sailor Chris! 20 goddamn dollars to say in honor 
of Steve's tireless research into human sexuality. Isn't that Simmons? Isn't that Simmons? Isn't Simmons the one that wants Simmons is the one that wants everyone to be gay for the sake of just pissing everyone that would be pissed if they're gay? I think that's Simmons. But either way, we'll say Steve. We'll say Steve. Can't take the shotgun. Fuck. No one's gonna help me. Yes, I also modded in the hilarious voice acting. So I added I added the enemy mods, I added the character mods, and I added the mods for all the voices from the original Resident Evil, which have actually been touched up. It's pretty great. It's kind of awesome. What's up, Iron Poot? Doing okay. I wanted to play uh, KOF 14 today, but it's just my PS4 Pro is acting weird. Yo, one, I think it's 1v1? 1v on? Thank you, dude. I, I'm gonna choose to kill this guy. Oh, shit. Give me my knife back, dickhead. It's locked. Spencer family emblem carved into the doorknob. Armor. Okay. And I don't think this goes anywhere. Beautiful Jen's also a brand new dude. Welcome, beautiful Jen. Deliver the tacos, please. Make sure there either might or might not be doggos out here. That's definitely a doggo. That's definitely a big pixely doggo. Don't need to be out here right now. Don't need to be out here right now. Not finishing the OG Saturn run? No, what I did is I met you guys halfway. What I did was I modded in all the old Polygon dudes into this one. So now we don't have to do the old Saturn one, we'll just do this one. Okay. I've come down to like a fucking empty horse balls. Unless I can go in here. Excuse me, dickhead. Oh, you can walk, you can go upstairs. Please don't barf on me. This is about to be a fucking problem. Wow. That went a lot better than I thought it would. Nice, I could finally save my fucking game. This is good. Okay. Got gas. Probably got... Oh, more of these. Got a flask over there. Mansion key, I'm gonna need that. I don't need this right now. Add those. I'm debating even using, even holding on to the survival knife for now just because I have such a limited inventory space. I've got the closet key if I ever want to change my looks. Start grabbing all this shit. Fuel canteen and fill it up with fuel. Holy shit! Sora Tenjo777, thank you very much, man. You didn't even leave a message. I appreciate it, dude. Okay, so that's now full of stuff. Might as well take some of these old keys. Poor man, Joestar is also a brand new dude. Thank you, Joestar. I appreciate it, man. How's the audio levels for you guys? Is the game a little bit too loud? Please let me know. Alright, I got nine fucking ink ribbons. Let's make a save here. Hiya, Busate! I feel bad about the RE1 movie, don't know, so I... I feel bad about that RE1 movie, don't know, so I... Can I get a ban until the stream ends? I think... I think you're okay, dude. I think... I think you're okay. I think you're okay, but thank you, man. I don't think that... I don't think that's warranted a ban. I'm pretty sure it doesn't line up with any of the bannable offenses that are down below in the channel rules, so I think you're okay. The audio is hurting your eyes, gotcha. Well, I mean, I made the graphics look better, so... These low-poly levels are too loud. They are too loud. Ah, fuck! Ah, oh, you're a dick! Ah, oh, fuck it.
Wow! Jesus Christ! Uh... Hey, about that shit? That guy's fucking head exploded. It just blew up for no reason. Oh, hi. You look great. You look- you look great. That's locked. Armor. If there's any enemies I can prevent from becoming evil assholes, I think we should. Nice. Okay. This is good. This is good. Yeah, it's weird there's gonna be an Xbox Scorpio coming out this year, and they're not gonna have any video games. It's gonna be really weird, man. I don't know what- they're gonna have to say something at some point. It wish to you to buy our system, but we have no video games. Of history. Crimson Lunar, thank you, dude. No, they're gonna have Halo Wars, I'm sorry. They're gonna have Halo Wars, that's it. There's so many- there's so many more doors in here. That's very true, Lily. Uh, the fence is a brand new dude. Doc was for the fence, I appreciate it, man. Can I use it here? No, this is the wrong door. This is the wrong door. Yeah, which you can all play on PC. Infinite Games, thank you for the five months, dude. What do I look like? I'm in a fish tank? Hey, that is unfair. That is unfair. We're going for maximum spoops here. Nice! I think I might be trying to use this thing up. I'm trying to use it up! Zambino? Yep, he's coming up those stairs. Nice! Shit. Good shit, Polygonal Chris. Get the facehugger, JJ! RPG Chicago, I don't wanna- You don't need to- You don't need to incite anything, okay? We don't wanna cause a riot. Don't wanna cause a riot. I got the Golden Kappa, he can use it, we can't. Shut the fuck up. Golden Kappa check? Is that you just type in Kappa? Hold on a sec, you bitches. Damn it, I ain't got no Golden Kappa, you're all liars! Black Knight Leader! Are you ready for a new challenger? The Hunters are back! What would you do if you were a secret boss in Marvel Infinite? Good luck, Max, may the taco pizza be with you. And C. Cotter, thank you for the five months. And Blockiest Mango was a brand new dude. Tacos for Blockiest Mango, I appreciate it, man. Thank you, dude. Black Knight Leader, what would you do if there were a secret boss in Marvel Infinite? That'd be sick! If there- if- Oh, if they- if the Hunters... Like, in this game? I don't think that would make sense. I'd put Tyrant as a secret boss. Um, I wouldn't be too- I wouldn't be too thrilled if it was just the, uh... If it was just a hunter. Well, I'm still- I'm still in Chaotian. I'm unlocking shit, though, which is good. Alright, let's keep going. Keep moving. Well, that guy's going upstairs. I'll let him do his thing. It smells faintly unpleasant. Nice! Good shit! This, I think I get the shotgun in here. Hey yo, DJ Low! I just want to say hello and keep up the amazing work. You did not have to give me ten bucks to say that, dude. But thank you very, very much, man. Holy shit. Granadas? Old shotgun. Yep, I was right. This takes up like two spots, right? No, it doesn't. Thank fuck. Thank fuck. Ink ribbons. Look at this! I'm blasting through this game right now. I don't know what the fuck is going on. Okay, so there's kerosene in there. I got the old shotgun. I think I kind of know. Did I have any hype for scale bound? I never thought it looked great, but I had hope that it was going to be great. And it didn't end up being anything, which is very fucking sad. Yeah, Scalebound was cancelled. Hold on a second, I'm checking my... Checking my... Welcome back to the stage of history. And that's what I wanted to fix. There we go. A dying penguin! Thank you for the four months, dude. And the rocket launcher and the flamethrower take up two spots. Okay.
Uh, let me see if I can get some interesting looks going on here. Because before, it was kind of weird when we, um... Let me try this. Hold on a sec, chat room. Did that make it more green? Not really. Not really. At, le at one point, I actually had a really interesting green, like, highlight to this thing. I swear to God, when I play Resident Evil, when I actually play RE7, I'm gonna set up lights and shit around us to make it as creepy as fuck. It's gonna be cool. Because I'm mostly gonna be playing this shit in VR. Uh, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Uh, Tahalamayas! Thank you very much, dude. Welcome! Tacos or Tahalamayas? I need armor keys, goddammit. Yeah, I know, I gotta turn off that hall light. Is the zombie gonna be upstairs? Sir? Yeah, you, you yak it up. Please be open. Nice! <laughs> Please be open. Please. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh my. Uh. Fuck me! I was trying to juke him! Now I can't do shit. Now I'm in pain. Brutalize. Ah, oh, fuck! Hold on! Ah! Oh, shit! Ah, oh, fuck! Ah, oh, I think another one in the face, you fuck! Maybe? Give me all my stuff back. PS4 Pro busted, thank you, dude. Take the damn dagger. This is going terribly. PS4 Pro busted or I, I described it like seven times. PS4 Pro came out with another update at some at some point. I don't know when the fuck it did. But the latest update um, made 1080p not work. 4K works fine now on my setup, but now 1080p doesn't work. So fantastic, right? It's fantastic. It was so it's, I mean, it's just great. So now I have to figure out a way to make 1080p work because it only shows I only get the sound from 1080p, and I don't get the signal. I just get black screen. That's locked. What the fuck? Okay, well, I need to find something to eat. Fuck it. Fantastic. Is this other door actually open to the sword key? Where the fuck does this go? Am I just getting confused here? Uh, yes I am. Yes, I sadly am. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I kept looking at the chat every time I left that room. Right in the Trap God, have you ever thought of playing Mass Effect on stream? Yes, I despise those games. I'd enjoy you running through this trilogy before Andromeda comes out. Sadly, not on this channel. I've, I've tried to play Mass Effect the first one three times, and I just couldn't do it. Everyone, everyone says they were really into it. I couldn't stand the gameplay, and I couldn't stand... Uh, I just not a, I am not a fan. Uh, don't like it. Let me go take this shit downstairs. Welcome back to the Logan Stryker, back for 34 months. Thank you, dude. That's a helmet key, okay. I'm all jacked up now. You're allowed to like it, I just severely dislike it. Severely. How do you do a golden kappa? You have to be one in like a million p fucking users to get a golden kappa. It's incredibly rare. It goes to like a random person, I'm pretty sure. Damn it, Chris, you're all fucked up. Are you really in danger? Am I one hit away from just getting ganked? I think I am. What about the second one? I don't have any interest. Like, it just... Everything about the Mass Effect series, like, it's... Space and... Aliens from other worlds, and it's Star Wars, the elements, don't do anything for me. 
they do nothing. Is this guy gone? No, there he is. Thank you. Thank you! Welcome back to the stage. Ordinary night, thank you, dude. Someone said, can you please answer my question and I'll be happy, as I could barely even finish, in, finish reading that guy's sentence and had to scroll up to even see it. I'm very sorry, dude. If, if, I, if I happen to randomly look at the screen and I see a question that I could easily answer, I'll answer it. Give me my real shotgun, god damn it. Ah! Fuck, I don't have enough room. I need, like... I am this close to dropping five bullets in some asshole. I am this close. Give me something I can pick open. Wait. Damn. It's a fireplace, though. Come on. You can't drop items. <laughs> drop the ink ribbons. I wish I could. I, I wish, yeah, I wish you could just sit items down. That game is called Resident Evil Zero and it's a, it's a nightmare. Go, Nintendo Switch hype soon. What do you expect and how do you feel about a Dark Souls collection supposedly coming out for it? That would be cool. I think that'd be, I think that'd be really cool. Um, they definitely need things like that to get people... To get people that wouldn't be normally Nintendo fans kind of excited. Because right now, I don't know about that system. Fuck. I don't want to go that way. Oh my god. Fuck it. I'll take it. One of these had a sword key, I swear to god. Armor. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Lucario EX96, thank you, dude. Talk was for Lucario. As a non-native English speaker, I have to ask why you use the term you're allowed to like it. Is the sound of something not allowing some... Okay, well, the reason is, if... In most most people, we're gonna say like 99% of people on the internet, because you guys aren't the 99%, you're the 1%, think that if I- yeah, thank you, Jessica. Th thank you very much for that. Think if you- popcorn. If you dislike something, <laughs> that means you hate the person that likes it. That- that happens all the goddamn time. So you have to remind people, oh, popcorn is delicious. What the fuck? Okay. Die, you fuck! Oh my god! I laid him out with bullets all the way until he got here. We can stop this now. This is getting frustrating. <laughs> Welcome back to the stage sure. of history. Uh, I'm okay. Boss Creeper, thank you, dude. And Lucario, I appreciate it, man. Dude, I shot that guy like 17 fucking times on the way to me. He literally would not die. Now I have enough to get this. Super Spark Plug, thanks, man. Christ. Bad Ender's Game, thank you, dude. And P. Henk, P. Henix, thank you for the six months. That zombie was ridiculous. He did not want to go down. Welcome back to the stage of history. Maybe not body shot him? Well, I'm pretty sure shooting in the head with the pistol is random. 
I'm pretty sure actually getting headshots is random. I mean, unless they changed it. Mm, look at where we're going. Locked, 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 locked. Uh, okay, so I've... Unlocked everything on this floor. Uh, Max doesn't bang blue girls, those space women need your hot space love, or space men, you know, whatever. I'm assuming that's related to Mass Effect, but I almost wouldn't know. But thank you! Hmm. That's unlocked, that's unlocked. That I can't get to. That I can't get to. Where's the one door? Hmm. There we go. They need dude love. They need the dude love. Fucking Zamboni. Nice. That's why I brought this back here. I was looking for this damn door. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Uh, Raiden right the Trap God, thanks man. I need to combine them, and eat them. Doggos, I swear to fuck. Don't you kill me. Chill. Okay, I'm gonna leave that out there. I'm gonna leave that out there. No, you can't get knives back from enemies unless you shoot them in the head. Unless their heads blow off. Yes, eat herb, less dead. Wonderful. Ah, you fucking doge! Time to run, Christopher. All right. Time to run, Christopher. Raiden the Trap God says, Don't you like space? It's every young boy's dream to be an astronaut. Not a proven fact. You should try it just one more time for the hell of it, or just skip ME1. Ah, uh, I think I'm good. It's like trying to convince me to watch modern day anime. It's just not gonna work. Okay, here we go. Mm. Look at this again. Where the fuck are we? Uh, okay. Do I actually have to go outside? What are gray doors? Are, are gray doors... Are gray doors the ones that you have not just been through? So if that's the case, then there's a there's a couple I have not been through. It's not that I hate Mass Effect, it's just that it's just more that I don't care. It's like trying to convince someone that's super into football to like soccer. I just I don't care. It's also that, like, anime- I, I watched anime at a point in my life where I was actually actively looking for entertainment. Um, I haven't really watched a lot of movies or TV in- in 10 to 15 years of my life. So it's been- it's been a long time. Like, it has ha I'm not really interested in going out and searching for entertainment. Welcome back to the stage 
Uh, yes. I think there's a fuckload of Zambinos down here. Uh, Artemis119, thank you for the two months, dude. And D-Town Muscle's a brand new dude as well. Thank you very much, D-Town. Give him a taco or two, please. Okay, let's hope this guy doesn't just, like, pull a 180 and grab my face. And I'm pretty sure it's this door. Let's see what gray means. You've never been in there. That's what that means. Death is everything. Is this a helmet? Is this a helmet key? To be expected. Uh-oh. MC Hammer. You go the fuck back. Creepy bastard. This is only beginning. Ten bucks from just shut up and like it! Just shut up and like Mass Effect, you fuck! Yes, okay, got it. I love Mass Effect. I love it. Whatever you've heard, I love it. Hmm. Hmm. There's a couple of doors on the other side that I have not been into. Um, at least on the second floor. There's- that's where I gotta go. That's where I gotta go. Thank you, sweetie. Lego Man 89 thank you, dude. But now I'm looking at a map all the time, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm gonna take this downstairs. Excuse me. Okay, those herbs are there. I wish I could leave a marker in this room. Hey, bullets! That's gonna take up all my inventory space, you fuck. Actually, no, it won't. I think I can drop it off right here. Any of these open up? Other side. And this one. Locked. I'm out of armor. Welcome back to this the one of history. Doesn't have. Uh, Red Oaks, thank you for the two months, dude. Nice, nice. That's what I was looking for. It's exactly what I was looking for. Welcome back to the stage. Cynical of Giant history. also back for three months and happy Dude Day, Tatsuya Fox. Holy shit, man! Thank you very much. I can't believe we made it all the way down to the kitchen already. Eh, I'm gonna leave that there for now. Uh oh. I wanna wake Captain Dude Bro up. Okay, so the power's off to the elevator down here. Captain Zombie McDude, man, there's a knife right there, which I want to grab. No, Chris. No, Chris. You fuck. I guess I'll take it. Okay. Oh, this scene! This, this is still here! 
Billy Valentine. Thank you, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. My polygonal ass. Regular Zambinos. Lily says some useful info. Uh, Chris can take six hits before dying. The door to the stairway save room only has three uses before breaking. It'll be fixed on your second visit to the mansion. Crimson Head spawn 30 to 45 minutes after. Wow. Fuck, I gotta hurry. I gotta, I gotta start going fast. This is why I've been kind of trying to avoid killing zombies. Welcome back to the stage of history. Gigapede, thank you for the 21 months, dude. Oops, I did not grab this Gemerald yet. Which I don't have any fucking room for because I'm Chris. That looks like, uh... 11 o'clock and... 2 o'clock, maybe? Maybe 10 and... 10 and 3? I can't do the puzzle yet. Yo, Xanderin! I wanted to say thank you for having such a positive attitude and making a long day better after work. Ah, oh, thank you, man. That's, uh... That's very good to hear. I appreciate that, Xander. Thanks, man. Pretty sure I can't go down here yet. That's normal. That's normal. I actually need to go to the second floor. The scene is just to showcase that zombies can open doors, but game day they do that in the original. That exact same scene happens in the original. So I gotta get the armor key. Nice. Fuck! Let's see what's in here. I got you, Lily. Yeah, we're gonna play several Resident Evil games before 7. Hey! That's- that would- that would be the dog whistle. Uh... Talking about how you can eat dank herbs and recover your fucking health for no reason. Welcome back. Damn it. Stage of history. Uh, Ultimate Azure, thank you for the 11 months, dude. And Snowman504, welcome back, man. Okay. There's some place I can drop all this stuff down there. And a zombie's right there. That's cool. I'm gonna lure this guy. Yak on me, son. There we go. That's one way to do it. Yeah, we'll be streaming the Switch event on Thursday. And then afterwards, probably playing Resident Evil 4. I don't think I need this just yet. Uh, did I get any more of these? Nope. Wait a minute. 
Did I, did I have to inspect the emblem? No. I thought I had to, like, look at it or some shit. The new Minecraft rocks! That's great to hear. I have never... That is amazing because I've never spoken to any person that actually has played Minecraft. It's today is a first. Thank you, dude. I'm gonna save. Fuck it. I'm like, I don't want to use my save ribbons, but they got so many. You gotta understand. I'm really sorry, I can't sympathize with you on Minecraft, because... ...myself in this chat room is- is full of a bunch of dirty old fucks that grew up in arcades and shit. So, we don't... We hate all that new stuff, like Mass Effect and Minecraft. I hear they're practically the same thing. So... I apologize. But thank you. Okay, make our way. Enigma! Thank you very much, Enigma. Ah! I gotta get back upstairs. Actually, I gotta make my way down to the end of this hallway. I'm gonna- I'm gonna lure Captain Zambino all the way to these stairs. Yeah, come here, sir. Can you come over here? You. Get over here. So you can't- you can only throw up on me. Come on. Come on. Ah, oh, fuck! Ah, oh, he threw up on me! Shit! Fine. Still doing fine. Welcome back to the stage oh. of history. Here's my lighter. Beyond the grave, thank you very much, dude. Welcome back. Yes, I get it. Can you, can you like grab it or, can you go reach up there and get it or some shit, Christopher? Lions carved in the relief door with intense heat. It's wonderful. It looks beautiful. Just do something about it, please. Ah, fuck it. I could have swore you could grab it. You need blank paper to get the map. Shit. Well, that ain't happening right now. Fuck! Fuck, fuck, fuck! Now I gotta get the dog whistle. But I gotta run back down and around. It's a wood plate. Let's go, crazy. This Mega Man looks great! Not as good as Minecraft, though. Thank you! Wow, holy shit. There's a Zamboni right here. Run right past him. Wow, the 180, sir. Oh, God damn it. God damn it. Oh, he hello. I'm gonna take this back in there. I'm gonna take this and go back in there. Right now. Ah, oh, fuck, come on! Stickhead! You just, you just enjoy that. You just sit there and you enjoy it. RE7 thoughts, thank you, dude. I know from the RE7 demo, you liked RE-style puzzles, but what are your thoughts on the presumed amnesia-like gameplay it'll have? I remember your sister didn't really like it, Alien Isolation, that much. Um, well, I played the demo and I love it, so, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. Burn that shit!
Nice. That shit's still locked. There's a door I haven't been in that I can't get to. Uh... Good to know. Let's see if we get this guy to lunge. Does he still have a knife in his head? Ah, fuck! Come on, camera, you piece of shit! You suck! You fucking suck! I'd rather you be a regular guy than a creepy Zambino. No. No. I'm very reluctant to kill zombies because they turn into the, the scariest, creepiest fucking enemies ever. If I start doing that. Uh, balcony on the west side of the terrace. Well, I have been here. Welcome back to the stage of history. This is locked, right? No. Uh, hollow shards. Thank you, dude. You could just burn them. That's in this fucking game. Burning zombies is in this game. Are you sure? Oh, the flask with the oil. That's right. That's right. It's all coming back to me now. It's all coming back to me now. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna go burn some zombies. I forgot about that. I forgot that's what the kerosene is for. Might as well start lighting them all up. You motherfucker! I swear to God! This camera is designed to murder me! At least I know where to go now. You know what? That's actually good, because I wasted so much fucking time getting these stupid Zambinos, like, giving these stupid Zambinos the chance to turn into dickheads that I should- I now I know where to go. It's better this way. Stinzink, thank you for the 20 months, dude. Now I know exactly where I should be going. Fuck, he was right at the brim of the camera. That son of a bitch. I think I'm in the same fucking room, too. Yeah, I am. I don't think I made, like, any progress. Like, no shit. I think I've made, like, zero progress from the last time we were in here. The only thing I did was... I did, like, maybe one or two fucking things. Hold on a sec. I'm gonna murder the fuck out of these guys. And then I'm gonna burn their bodies. If you blow off their heads, do they also not become, uh... they not become... red guys if you... shoot their heads off? Is that a thing? Where my canteen? Yeah, I need to do the map and the dog whistle. E-Rock Hip Hop, thank you, dude. So... This is totally fucking worth it to do this to him. Eat a dick, sir. Oops, I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to do that. So every every single fucking zombie I run into now, I'm blowing their heads off. 
I am I am blowing their fucking heads off. Like this is absolutely worth the shotgun shells. Come here, asshole. Ah oh, shit. Didn't work. Didn't work. There we go. Ow, my legs, fuck. Yeah, and I just I just understood that the headshot doesn't always work. Headshot doesn't always work. I'll take this. Yes. I'll see you later. There we go. ISSJ Kensai. Thank you very much, dude. Welcome, Kensai. Tacos for that guy. I'll take it. Let's go get that damn dog whistle now. I'll take this oib. I'm gonna still try to avoid zombies as much as I possibly can, but yeah. Pretty sure what I want is like right beyond this door. Captain Puerto Rico! <clears throat> I love your work and the dudes put out so, so, so consistently. Keep it up. Uh, care to treat viewers to a too spooky story? P.S. Thank you for introducing me to Guilty Gear XR. It's so blowing my mind. That game is great. The game is fucking great. From the professor! Fire indeed hot. Thank, thanks, pro. Thanks, professor. I'll take the bullets. Okay, so where is this? Uh, care to treat the viewers to a spooky story? <sighs> um... I gotta go back downstairs. The best one I could think of is the uh, the story that I told a few years back, like two and a half years ago, about Welcome back to the, stage the of fucking uh, the marbles, marble story. Perker Upper, thank you for the six months, dude. Um, when I was a kid, we lived up in the woods, right? Um, like in in the woods, and I, uh... yo, Ornstein, thank you so much. Talk was for Ornstein. Thank you, dude. I l I remember, um, at one point in my room in one of the houses we lived there because we lived in like several house houses. Uh, there was one night where it got extremely cold in the room and I just felt like really freaked out. Uh, Nova Star tacos for Nova Star. Thank you, man. So um, let me fill this up with kerosene. Um, so when I I. I just hid under my covers because it always got randomly cold in that house, and it was like because it was it was always cold up in the mountains. But um, I noticed that it started to get really cold, like severely cold, and the mobile. I had a little mobile of the solar system. That things like a mobile is this thing that would hang and had like just like cutouts of Jupiter and Mars and you know all the planets, and it's and it was spinning like crazy. It was actually like moving relatively fast in a circle and I didn't know what was going on if there was like a breeze or something because I didn't feel a breeze it just felt very cold so I uh, started hearing the sound the very distinct sound of like across a wood floor uh, like a marble rolling across a wood floor like that sound of something very thick and that's like in a ball form rolling 
uh, but I had carpet in my room, and it sounded like it was right next to my bed. Like, it was right next to my bed. Um, and it would go, it would, it would start, and then it would stop. And it would start, and then it would be like it would roll forward and roll back, and roll forward and roll back, but it didn't sound like it was under the floor. It sounded like it was right, that shit is right fucking there. Uh, so after a while, it kept happening, and whenever I would turn on my light to the room, uh, my light was right next to the bed, I'd flip that shit on, and as soon as I did, it would go away. Every single time. As soon as I turn on the light, it would stop, and I'm like... I'm like, it's just something under the floor. But as soon- when it started, like, reacting to when I... would turn the light on and off, that's when I was like, okay. I turned the light on, I went upstairs to my dad's room. Um... Or my, my mom and my dad, and I'm like, uh, guys, there's something- there's something happening in my bedroom. Wait, hold on a sec. Fucking Zambino. That guy's gonna be a problem. Eventually. Uh, so I- I told- I told him, and my dad went, he's like, okay, I'll just go- he, my- I, I stayed upstairs, and he went to go stay downstairs for a while, and then just sleep in my bed. And, as he went down there, he came up about 20 minutes later, and he's like, yeah, there's something going on in Max's room. And apparently when he went down there, the light was off. Like, the light that was- that I turned on, and I just left on. My dad went back down there, and he- the light was off. And he just fell asleep. And then apparently the same shit started happening to him. It got super cold, things started- like, the mobile started moving around the room. And he started hearing the exact same thing, like, what sounded like marbles rolling across the floor. <coughs> Story doesn't end there. Um, it kinda- it kinda stopped, but... Other people in my household started getting really bad nightmares. Uh, like, really, 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 like, fucking horrible screaming in your sleep kind of nightmares. And then one day... One day, my mom... Is this the terrace that they're talking about? I don't think it is. It's on the second floor. Fuck me. Where the fuck is this... Terrace? Um, and then one day, my mom was at the grocery store. It's a very small town, right? This is up in the mountains. By blowing into it, it generates the frequency only audible to the ears of dogs. You can call a dog with this whistle. I don't think this is where I want to be. Um... Mom was at the grocery store, ran into someone that she knew, and was talking to him, and she seemed all stressed out, and she started talking to her about her daughter that was having these nightmares. And they were... They were way worse than what my family was going through, because her daughter ended up walking out into the street. And one night, this was the night before it happened, before my mom met her in the grocery store, she talked to her, and she said that her daughter was in the street, saying something along the lines of, I don't want to buy any marbles. I don't want to buy any marbles, and screaming it into the street. And the daughter later said that it was a small uh, Native American boy that was trying to sell marbles to her. And could, and she just, and she, he wouldn't leave her alone. Uh, and apparently did a bunch of research and stuff and found out that there was actually a lot, a lot of Native American history around that area. Like, a lot. And a lot of shit that pushed them out from people that, um, from, well, essentially fucking America pushing them the fuck out. So, uh, my mom found that out and she's like, all right. My mom's a very spiritual person. She did, like, a, a seance in the room. She burned a whole bunch of sage, and she burned a whole bunch of... Pretty much stuff that's supposed to be... That's supposed to drive, um, spirits out. And ever since she did that, she did, like, a prayer in the room, and did all this stuff, and after that happened, uh, it never came back, and that was it. <laughs> ah, fuck you, Jessica! <laughs> oh my god. I fucking suck. You, you take over the street. You street. You fucking street. You go show the chat what you did. Oh god. For mail time, someone actually sent Max marbles. <laughs> this is a bag of marbles, guys. Marbles. I knew he was always going to tell that story. That's hilarious. I never had any ghost stories. That was horse shit. <laughs> you scared the fuck out of me, dude. You're not allowed in here anymore. <laughs> I 
was dumb. <laughs> Holy shit. I've never, I haven't had that much adrenaline in a long time. <laughs> Holy shit. All right. After We're, you tell a ghost story, then you guys start getting chills and it, 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 it gets to you. All right, get out of here. Aww. I'm gonna eat all this popcorn. <laughs> bye, chat. Say bye to marbles. Get, the, get out of here. God. Triple combo. Benny, you get out of here too. Get all these dogs out of here. God. This is two dogs and a waifu. Well, that was dumb. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Where the fuck is this terrace? Uh Where is it? I need I need I need to know. I just I just really want to know now. Which doors haven't I actually gone into? Was that actually the terrace? I think it is. I'm actually asking right now so I don't waste any more goddamn time. Was that the terrace, guys? Is that it right out there? Max wearing brown pants, it didn't get that bad. Oh. Second floor by the medical room. Alright. Alright, let's just go back out here and go the fuck upstairs. Christ, it's marble, baby! I love that story and I'm glad you didn't lose my marbles. I, I don't tell that story a lot. The last time I told it was when we were fucking playing... Oh god, oh fuck. Yeah. It was when we were playing... Fatal Frame, many a year ago. This one's for JJ, thank you, dude. Thank you very much, man. <sighs> oh, fuck! I'm going the wrong way. I'm- I'm super discombobulated now. I'm super discombobulated now. Left side of the mansion, second floor, grayish metal door. Fuck! Can I even get in it though? Hmm. Damn it. It's this door, okay. Okay. Twenty one! I won! Suck my dick! Suck my dick! Yeah! Marble matchup too strong, thank you. It's very nice of you. Very compassionate. Ryuko Saka also back for 28 months. Thank you, dude. Oh, I need a small key. Well, I'll go get one. I'll, I'll go grab a small key and I'll head over there. And she got me pretty fucking good. You know why she got me good? Because it was the sound of something... So not what you were expecting. It was the sound of, like, crunching marbles and it was loud as dicks in my ear. It's Mobble Baby! Thank you, man. It was really loud. Like, that shit was in my ear. I'm surprised she... I didn't hear anything. I'm not surprised I didn't hear it. I feel bad. I let you down, chat room. <sighs> I'll not suck your dick. No, definitely not. Okay. Make our way over there. This is the right way. All 
All right, here we go. Have a good night, Gowari. See you, dude. Yes, I'll archive that scare. God damn it. I caught her earlier. She had like the little stuffed dog right next to my head. Welcome I caught it earlier. Naya Cake, thank you for the four months, dude. Ah! Asshole. Main room, second floor, sword key. But I used up the sword key. I used up the sword key. Mugen Blade! Thank you very much, Mugen Blade. Tacos for that guy. Welcome, dude. Welcome. It's locked from the other side. That's armor key. There's only four doors in here. Yeah, I think it's yeah, we gotta go to the left side. Part-time profit, thank you, dude. Because they said the west side of the mansion. The only outdoor place I had been to so far was that one with the dog, so I thought that was it. Welcome back to the stage of history. Sire Pug, thank you, dude. I'm assuming it's this door. Practice for RE7? No, more like just getting hyped for it, you know? I'm just excited. Uh, Dark Justice Hardcore, thank you, dude. Hmm. There we go. Got it. <clears throat> what the fuck? Welcome back to the stage of <sighs> Fuck! I blasted that dog with a shotgun and he didn't go down. Guess that's what these herbs are for. That Atmo, though. Discard the dog whistle. Got it. Fuck you, nothing unusual. Press the button. Welcome there we go. to the stage of history. Now that, now that, Shadow Wrath, thank you, dude, and Grim Sage, thank you as well. Rasmafu is also a brand new dude. God damn, new dudes everywhere tonight. Thank you very much, guys. Let him have the tacos. I believe this goes on the first floor, at the end of that one big ass hallway. Where's the hell is that big ass hallway? Mm. This is the imitation of the key, so I have to use it on that one. Hey, oh, J kid, what's up, dude? Um, fuck. Which hallway is it? Hmm. I'm trying to remember where that where that one specific spot was. Bryce Crispy, that's also a brand new dude. Thank you very much, Bryce. I appreciate it, man. Tacos for Bryce. 
Uh, I'm just gonna start heading back left. See how it goes. Third floor west. Okay. It's like up there. Got it. Gonna let the Leon Kennedy zombie pass. Excuse me, sir. Nidoran, I'm going to try to do an RE7 VR run first time. I'm gonna try. Um, that game does make me kind of nauseous. So I'm gonna give it my best shot. But I might switch, I might have to switch over. So, we shall see. And that's a crimson head. Fuck me. I should have burned that motherfucker. I really should have burned that guy. That guy's like guaranteed to be a crimson head. Multi black steel, ten bucks. Would you ever consider simultaneously streaming on YouTube? In an area without ISIS size being in YouTube player, it's much faster than Twitch. Um, not really. Um I know some people do that, they stream from YouTube and Twitch at the same time, but uh I'm not I don't know, I've never actually thought of it before. I'll consider it multi black. If I actually do get shit figured out. Please open this door. Damn it. Well, now I gotta take out this guy. If you burn him, he comes to life earlier? How the hell does that make any sense, Punisher? What the hell? Well, time to gun up. I got two shots. Come on, motherfucker. He's gone. Where the fuck did he go? Where the hell did he go? Okay. We just gotta start opening fucking doors. I'm fine. Anonymous just said, good evening, Max. What's up, dude? Thank you, as always, Anonymous. No, the difference between, um... Max is... Max1160 saying, Did you not care for Dark Souls, Chaos Code, Asura's Wrath, and Titanfall 2? N With all those games, it's not that I didn't care for them. It's that I just had never played them. And I wanted to play them. With the Mass Effect games, they are set in a universe and have gameplay that I actively despise. And I've given it multiple shots and I just don't care. With Dark Souls, like, I, I was introduced to the Dark Souls series through Bloodborne, and what happened after I played Bloodborne? I played Dark Souls, and then I played all the rest of the series. Titanfall 2, I played the first Titanfall, and I, I had no interest in playing the multiplayer, which is what the first Titanfall was all about, but I played the single player to Titanfall. And Asura's Wrath, I just never played. I knew it was probably good, but I just never played it. With Mass Effect, I actually have reasons that I personally do not like it. Like I said, it's going up to a soccer fan and convincing him to like, or it's going to a NFL fan and convincing him to like soccer. I'm not a big fan of like space drama. Ah! Oh, what the fuck is wrong with him? Oh my god! No! Oh! <sighs> that really freaked me out. <clears throat> that really freaked me out. Holy shit. Holy shit.
Oof. Oof. Yeah, the second shot was wasted, but I really wanted to be sure. I was genuinely freaked the fuck out. I did not want it coming back to life. Okay. Doesn't Jill show up now? Damn it, Jill, where are you? I gotta find Rebecca first, you know. Oh. Man, there's a lot of backtracking with Chris. Holy shit. There's a lot. This guy's pants keep fucking changing color, it's freaking me out. Okay, 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 okay. I don't know where Becky is. This is my first time playing through this game with Chris, yeah. I guess I'll go pick up this gem and go drop it off in a box. I'm gonna go to the second floor, uh, door on the east, and we're gonna start going through there. And I'm actually gonna go pick up the other shotgun- Oh, I can't. I don't have enough room. Fuck me. Oh, yes? Can I help you? Troll-ass woman! There's a way to play through as modern, Chris, absolutely. This is a mod. This is a mod of old, uh, old polygons. Nice. Ah, fuck! Ah! Oh, turn it off! Jesus! <laughs> what the hell? Let's go, what the hell? Broken CM Gordo rule... Rules number of the zombie land, double tap. Thanks, man. What the fucking... Do I go back in and it's fine? Well, god damn it. That's not what I wanted at all.
Oh, fuck you! Okay. That one doesn't do shit. That guy probably pushes that one in. No, no, no. There we go. I was about to say. Now push that button. It's going to be fine. Aha! Aha! Okay. I'm eating popcorn like I'm in a movie theater during an action scene. Oh my god! Fuck you, Christopher. Oh, whatever the fuck's in this door. Oh, I know it's in this door. I know it's in this door. Oh, god damn it. Hold on a sec, chat room. Are all those doors really locked? I need to go downstairs anyway. Rice Crispy, thank you for the ten bucks, dude. A friend of Bombage has been watching you since the seventh grade. I came on to make him jealous since you noticed me before him. Tell me you love me more than him. Love you from Bombage. Holy shit. That is a long time. Oh, Wesker being a good boy. I love you, Wesker. I love you. Thank you, Bryce. I appreciate it, too. You might be my youngest viewer. Pick up the bullets. Looks like 35, 36. I'm getting- I'm getting some reminiscence of Resident Evil Zero playing this game as Chris because of the limited inventory. Starting to get a little reminder of that game. I should save it. I should fucking save it. I should save it. I should- I should not be risking this. Should I have enough save items? You already lost on the character select screen. It definitely makes this game fucking harder, dude. Like, that is- that is absolutely true. Okay. I just need to lay waste to some asshole zombie and we should be good. Okay, where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? We just gotta start hitting up red doors. Doors that are locked. Back to the stage of Hulk history. Stand H! Thank you, dude. Let's go down here. Whoa. Fuck! Fuck! We're now. Up and around. Nice! There's one.
I like RE5, yeah. I think RE5 is a fun game. With you, when you play with someone else. Damn, I have no fucking space for anything. Small key. Ink ribbon. Even more shit. Okay, I gotta come back to this room. This was just easy because I actually can. So I'm gonna go dump off all my ammo and stuff and come back and grab everything in this room. Go see Richard and Rebecca. I don't know where they are. I actually don't know. I've never played Chris's campaign before. Yeah, no, I want to do that. Uh, fade box. Let me reload before I do this. Oh, motherfucker, I didn't grab him. Amiza, thank you so much, and the one guy who rhymes. Thanks, man. That's not a bad idea of just reloading your weapons and just taking your weapons and a key. It's when you don't have to press the button when you go upstairs in this game. It's a wee bit different. No, I didn't beat Final Fantasy XV. You gotta find another chance to play it at some point. Too much shit is coming out. Whoa, 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 Christopher. We actually did get a copy of Mario Party 1. Uh, game day. So we're gonna play that eventually. Costs 50 fucking dollars. That was good. That, that opened up a spot. Welcome I mean, that precious inventory. Actually is Dolan. Thank you, dude. good on the lore. I'm good. Kind of know what happens in these games, sort of. John Morty, best night ever. Got the two next two days off. I got you killing zombies while I'm ripping and tearing in Doom. Let's go. That game is fantastic, John. That was best game of 2016. Easy. The hook for fishing. Well, fuck. Okay. I'm gonna drop all this shit off. Most expensive game I've ever purchased? Um... It's a good question. I guess if I can find it, hold on.
Yep, I got it. This is the most expensive game I've ever purchased. I'm gonna tilt it at a direction you can actually see it. Uh, this cost about $350. Steel Battalion wasn't even that expensive. I think Steel Battalion with everything was $200, 250 But, uh, yeah, I keep this in a collective case. It's actually in pretty goddamn good condition as well. It's pretty good. It's the rarest Sega Saturn game there is. And it's one of my favorite series of all time. Ooh. Let's drop off some of this shit. Yeah, no, that's not Panzer Dragoon 1, that's Panzer Dragoon Saga. It's the one that came out at the end of the Dreamcast's lifespan. Oh, I'm sorry, the Saturn's lifespan. And it is pretty fucking hard to find. They made like... I think it was less than 5,000 units or something like that. It was quite a few. I watched the speedrun of Doom, I thought it was great. I thought it was great. Keep the hook? Oh, keep the fish hook. Okay. I'll do that. I'll do that. I'll hold on to that shit. Are we doing anything special for this run, or is it just a normal run through? No. No. We're not doing anything special at all. Nothing special at all. Normal run through. Completely normal. Casual, normal run through. Popcorn is addictive as fuck. Wow. My arcade cabinet games? Um, believe it or not, none of my arcade cabinet games cost as much as this. Like this, this, just this game costs more than all my arcade cabinet games. Except one. Except a very specific one. And it's Dance Dance Revolution. <laughs> that one was pretty expensive. Fuck! Wrong room. It's funny is that I got the DDR cabinet four years ago. I got it for a really good price, um, considering how much I've actually used it, and... I, I got it for less than what most couches cost, which is kind of funny. I think there's one thing over here. Yeah, I got it for like... If you buy a piece of furniture that would go into a living room to take up that space, which is where our Dance Dance Revolution machine eventually went, then... Uh, it's- it's actually cost less. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa! Uh, if anyone- if anyone starts giving advice- You don't have to do it right now, but I'm gonna say... If- it, if anyone starts giving advice on Resident Evil, um... On the game we're playing right now, and I'm not asking for it, then go ahead and give them 600 second timeouts. That's just a warning for you guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Nothing happens. It's a lure! Well, I wonder what that goes with. Fish hooks came from.
Wait. There we go. Eventually you click around fucking everywhere. Of course. Of course. Someone mixed up the bug and the lure. That'll get me outside eventually. Sorry about the mouse cursor. Oh goddamn bees! Huge bee! Damn right, Chris. You tell him who's boss. I'm gonna take this and I'm never gonna come back. See you later, dickhead bees. else in here? I think this was it. I think I grabbed everything eventually. Yo, the bombage! First off, fuck you, Bryce. Secondly, I'm 20 now and I've been watching you for literally years. Thank you for being awesome, dude. <laughs> Thank you, the bombage. I appreciate it, man. Yeah, if you've been watching me since 7th grade, you're probably about 20, 21 years old now. That is absolutely true. That is absolutely true. I appreciate it, though. Thank you for watching for so goddamn long. It was very nice of you, dude. Okay, we got everything in here. Get the fuck out. We did play the remaster. We actually played the remaster back in early 2015. And when it came out. But I played through it as Jill. So now it's been two years since I've- so I've pretty much forgotten almost fucking everything. And we're playing as Chris. Hold on a sec. There we go. Uh, enter input. Let's do this. Super humble. Hey, Savaro, thank you very much, dude. Tacos for Savaro. Welcome, man. Okay, that's a bit better. Now you guys can actually see the green horse shit in the room. Uh, Hasio Sora, thank you for the 17 months, man. The wind crest. Actually, let me combine this shit. Might as well. Helix Dragonite, welcome back, man. The thing is, we usually play a genre of games that not a lot of younger people appreciate. So it actually does make me really happy when I eventually run into someone that's like 16 or 17 and they're like, Hey, I love the stuff you do. It's like, holy shit, that's actually kind of cool because... Usually they're grown-ass adults. Like, anytime someone usually comes up to me, um, in public or at a an event or a convention, they're like, man, I've been watching your shit for years, I love it, it reminds me of the arcades and stuff, and it's like, they're always dudes that are in, like, mid-twenties to early forties. I'm completely fine with that. But at the same time, it is kind of know that if, good to know that a few younger kids are actually kind of getting into fighting games in some way. Let me fucking save, hold on a second. I have 12 save ribbons, I'm never gonna use all those. You calling me old, bruh? Yes. Yes, I am. Enjoy it. Cherish it. As we've- as we have defined in this chat room, the older you are, the better you are. The older you are as a subscriber, the, uh, the, the better you become because you get the eventual scrub lord face. Uh, Sutorito! I'm a fan from Portugal and love your streams, thinking about playing other classic Resident Evils. Keep your Jill sandwiches together. Thank you, dude. I think I am going to get the, um... I think I'm going to get Resident Evil 2 done. Rarest Saturn game. That's probably Daytona Championship Circuit. Yes, it is! I think this goes for like 600. 
But it's hard as fuck to find, you'll never find one. Demon Lord Mudkip for 13 months, thank you, dude. But at the same time, it's the exact same game as Daytona USA Circuit Edition, but it's just online. It's like me saying that Virtua Fighter Remix Longbox is extremely is one of the rarest Sega Saturn games. It's not the game, it's just the box. Um... What the fuck? I think I'm good with this. I think I'm okay with this. Palkia Chaos, thank you for the 17 months, dude. Yeah, I'm looking forward to finishing FF13. I want to finish it. Oh, I'm sorry, 15. Not 13. Woof. That's right. I'm gonna play Resident Evil 6. I gotta find some sick-ass mods for RE6, though. Hello? What haven't we opened in this hallway? Did I just go the wrong way? I did. Great. Fuck, he's gonna come back. No, 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 I went in here, I went in here, I went in here. I went in here, I went in here. Welcome back to the stage of history. Let's go, Kratos! Zach, thank you, dude. Hey, Max, buddy, old pal. If you get puked on by the zombies multiple times, you're gonna get gonorrhea. The only way to cure it is to mix blue herbs with red herbs. And use the look command to stuff up your asshole. <laughs> Thank you. Use the look command to stuff it up your asshole. 